are you? I'm just passing on your qualifying goals for this weekend. Alright guys, how's it going? Back for another video with my Robot Cubitsa season. Um, I thought I'd show you a little bit of me R&D tree. Um, for the first season I think I want to concentrate on the durability side of things um, and then work on aerodynamics and a chassis. I'm um, not going to bother with the powertrain as it's quite OP at the minute. But I'm going to concentrate on them three and then try and get the Williams and the sort of top few cars. But anyway guys, I really struggled around here. Um, around China, Sector 2 was really killing us. Um, I had to even resort to going on time trial. Yes, I know. What? To get a setup. I know. Hold the front page. But anyway, here's the setup that I used. Um, it was quite it was quite good. Made the car a lot more stable. Um, but I was still struggling in Sector 2. Um, struggling, like just not be being able to get me power down to be quick but anyway um just showing you this was the sort of the last stage of qualifying um i reckon i could have probably i think i got a mid 35 i reckon i could have got in the 34s um maybe it's even quicker if i managed to knock a lap together but like I probably would have got in the 34s if I really pushed it. Um, but like I say, I didn't really practice much. Um, it's not an excuse, I know. But anyway, guys, um, on at the race, I think I started way back in the field. Like, where am I? 15th. Still in front of Massa. But here we go. Later on, bang. Out we go. Got a good, decent start. Went alongside Alonso. See you later. You little Raji. So I kept on the inside of the line, um, going into the first corner. Cars are quite slow around here. Managed to overtake quite a few back in, try to kick out there. Managed to save it. Hulkenberg was on my left. He managed to keep his position. Um, but anyway, I slotted into 10th after the first corner. So gained five positions. Um, managed to overtake two into, into this turn. Um, Ricardo again, like, he really is getting the 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 brunt of my sort of racing career um, again this is the end of the first lap managed to try and squeeze Magnussen out but I tried to squeeze Ocon out as well but he managed to hold his line and I just backed off let, let him through um, I did manage to overtake him straight away again coming into the first turn um, so the start of lap 2 I'm into 6th um, great start again by Robert Kubica it seems to be an, a, a normal thing for him now to have lightning start um, let's hope I can carry that over or he can carry it over should I say anyway on to lap 4 um, the guys behind us were keeping up with us but I was just trying to show you this sector too like um, these are the corners I'm really struggling with kind of get me power down like really tentative on the power and it's making us slow guys ahead of us were just pulling away um, still on lap 4 I ended up getting a radio message off the engineer saying that my power was down due to my engine um, being a bit worn so that wasn't good so now I'm down on power um, but anyway after I lap on to lap 6 came out the pits managed to come stay ahead of the guys who were behind us so no one got the jump on us on to lap 8 um, still in 6th position um, Magnussen was doing a good job of holding up Ricardo for us um, as you can see I'm like I'm slightly pulling away from them this was on lap 10 and got a message for Stappen was out the race so I was like yes in the fifth um, poor Verstappen but anyway on to lap 12 I was really raging when this happened Ricardo ended up getting past Magnussen um, and thought he'd get his own back on me um, clipped the inside of me car and nearly spun us out and overtook us for the position which I think he has another replay of it his sort of another bird's eye view of it um, so literally just drove down the inside maybe he's left him too big of a gap but anyway he got his own back for all them overtakes I've done on him the past two races um, but anyway on to the end of the lap I think I managed to settle for six Magnussen had a little dive down on the last lap but I managed to fend him off 
Um, so there we go, guys. Sixth place for Robert Kubica. Started 15th. So gained nine positions. Um, not as many as the first race, but I think I've lived up to the legend yet again. Um, he has the standings after the first two races um, into fourth. 32 points behind the leader. And that was it. Anyway, quick sort of little gander at the engine and stuff. The, the way of the components. Combustion engine and the internal combustion engine is sort of 50 odd percent gone. The rest of them are nearly getting there. So it looks like I'm going to have to be probably changing these parts for the next race. So I should have a more powerful car for Bahrain. And also, I think I'm getting an upgrade to the chassis. Um, so all looking good, guys. I see you in the next race. Thanks for watching.